them always see the night. They say they want a real one. They say they want a real one to make them feel yo. Hey yo, what's good family? Welcome back to Astro Nori for another video. Today we're actually gonna be talking about every item that I bought for spring summer 2020. I might miss some items by default cause there's so much shit that I did buy, but I do wanna go ahead and cover as much as I possibly can. If you guys end up enjoying this video, go ahead and slap a fat like on it. Let's see if we could get this to 200 or 300 likes. This is gonna take a minute to record. I am gonna kinda like rush through it cause there's so much shit right here that I don't even know if this is all of it but i'm gonna go ahead and talk about it for you guys if you do end up enjoying y'all already know what to do subscribe to the channel and without any further ado let's go ahead and get straight to it so i'm not gonna lie i'm over here just winging it like i don't even know what i got so far but the first thing that we got was these incense right here i'm not really gonna do too much b-roll or anything this just comes with a little stick inside of it nothing too special it is supreme at the end of the day this did come in a white color and a black color we also did cook up on the supreme oreos shout out to some of our subscribers because i actually bought these for resale and low-key they hooked it up this is fire though i got a bunch of these another accessory that i bought this season was the the supreme instax i did just unbox this probably like a couple videos ago fire piece nonetheless these are cool for like vacation and shit we got the supreme lock as well the lock is actually fire the transparent lock i believe this was this season at the beginning don't really remember but we did get the lock you guys will notice that i am actually selling some of these pieces like this frog tee is probably up on astro bodega by now this is the daniel johnston it says i know supreme with the little frog design right there it's clean i just don't know if i'll wear it too much to be honest we managed to get the cutoff logo crew neck this is the black colorway and honestly bro i don't even know if i'll end up wearing this i love subtle and i love supreme but maybe if this was a hoodie i would have kept it it's nothing too special i feel like down the line that piece might end up going up who knows i don't to be honest now we're gonna kind of rapid fire through some tees i have a lot of tees this season i do not know if this is all of them but i'm gonna try my best to cover what i got we have like this 3d logo supreme right there i forgot the name of this one actually but it's pretty clean one of my favorite designs from the season i did manage to get the t and also did get the skate deck the skate deck is actually fire i'll probably end up putting this somewhere in my room definitely keeping this piece because once i get my own crib all these skate decks are going to be like in an art style format i do not know if this is from this season this is fire i forgot if i got it this season to be honest but i do feel like it's pretty recent either the end of fall winter 19 or the beginning of this season pretty clean big design on the back we got this smoke logo t right here i feel like this is from this season i also did manage to get the skate deck which i will throw some b-roll over me talking right now the skate deck is actually fire i feel like it actually completes that little section of my room this t is hard as well definitely a clean piece we have this morph t which i feel like a lot of people slept on this is a hard ass design that people just didn't go for it has all these cats on the back and shit this is definitely a hard t i don't know why people slept on this one we actually gave one of these away in the giveaway next we got the boat logo t i feel like this one is going to be one of the ones that goes up and resell like crazy i hands down believe so it's already low key going up some of the t's that dropped around this time are hitting those prices already so i definitely feel like this one will do the same and have that effect where it typically tends to go up as time goes on fire piece big supreme branding on it as well we got this dragon t i believe it's called a lot of people feel indifferent about this one but this is hard bro this reminds me of like cash money albums or like cash money tees back in the day you got that money raining you got the dragon the supreme bling logo fire bro hands down one of my favorite tees from this season not even gonna lie about that one we got the shop tee right here this is the classic logo without the little line on top of it definitely a fire design and a color that i typically do not buy is this orange color that's probably one of the reasons i'm actually keeping this tee and i feel like this is a simple classic way to get into it fire color we got this supreme sacred long sleeve it has all these designs on the front this is from one of their previous hoodies that they released which is actually fire as well but this one does have a bunch of logos right here which spell out supreme then you got that supreme fake box logo on the front which is clean in my opinion we have one of my favorites which i don't even know if this released this season i might be wrong but i 
feel like low key it did. It is the banner tee. This shit is fire. This tee is hard, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. This is probably another one of my favorites. I feel like this season low key had a lot of banger tees. This being one of them. I do also like the skate deck that came with this design. I just feel like the design was overall pretty clean. Another banger piece was this right here. This is the Supreme City Lights rayon shirt. Low key, this was about to get sold. When I made that video selling my Supreme collection, this was about to be on there, but I don't know if I wanna let this one go. It's just way too clean to let go. Especially looking at it in the camera, bro. I can't let this shit go. It's an overall just clean ass piece that you could wear out to like a slight dinner type vibe. I also did get Ziploc bags. I got three packs of these. Shout out to Marco for these right here. I actually managed to get three of them, which is pretty clean because I feel like I will end up using these right here. Got that Supreme logo on one side, Supreme Ziploc on the other. We also have this frog beanie, which I'm probably selling at this point. I did get this one with Addict IO, and I do want to say that a lot of these pieces that I showed you guys today, Addict IO was actually able to cook up on most of these releases. So I do recommend you guys to go ahead and check them out once they are selling again. Right now they are sold out. So if you guys do want to check them out, all you have to do is sign up for their newsletter, which will be at the top of the description. Once you do that, you will be notified whenever they do release the bot. It's going to be super, super limited. And once again, they did cook up on most of these releases from least hype to most hype. They covered it all. They covered like 85 different stores like Kids, Supreme Undefeated, Vape Palace, and they just added Yeezy Supply on there as well. So you definitely do not want to miss out on checking out Addict.io. I do have a promo code for 10% off, which is Astro, if I'm not mistaken. If you do that, you get $13 off. And if you can't afford the full price, you can split it in four different payments using Sezzle, which is actually pretty lit. But if you do want to check it out, the link will be at the top of the description. Just enter in the newsletter and get notified whenever they do release the bot. And with all that being said, let's get into the rest of this video. Then we're straight about the building. So yeah, honestly, I didn't set up the bot too many weeks this season, but they did cook up on this beanie for me right here. The frog beanie, which is being sold currently. Go ahead and check out Astro Bodega. We managed to get these cotton cinch pants, which I actually took a picture with my girl with. These are fire. I love the fact that these pants just have the subtle branding right here. They got the little cinch at the bottom to tighten them. You can wear these shits whenever. Super clean. We also did buy these Supreme Over dyed shorts low key i've been wearing these shits like all the time i'm not even gonna lie bro these are like everyday shorts for me i do feel like i could have sized down to a large because they are a little bit long and a little bit wide but they are fire nonetheless all i have to do really is just shrink them and they'll be right my size this season was actually infamous for the hats bro starting week i believe i got this hat right here which was the camo hat this shit is fire bro camp cap as you can see right there got that patch logo on the front that chocolate chip camo on this is crazy to be honest i really love this hat right here we also did get the matching waist bag with the chocolate chip camo on it this waist bag is also fire i'm not even the type to buy waist bags but this one right here i had to go for got that supreme logo on the bottom supreme behind the mesh probably one of my favorite bags in a while if they would have done this in a shoulder bag that was actually fire i would have definitely went for that another hat that i got was this s logo dad hat right here this is like a blue denim color it says supreme on the back got the little metal buckle right there supreme arc logo like i said i love the blue fade that this one has it's just a perfect fit we also got this over dyed beanie in like a royal blue colorway it's like a dark royal almost got that branding right there this is like my third beanie with this design i got like an olive one as well i forgot what other color but i got a couple of these now we also did get this splatter beanie if i'm not mistaken this is another clean one this beanie came in a black and a white i don't even know if i'm gonna sell this one but i do like this beanie right here this season we had the Ramelzi collab which is another one that I thought was fire low-key I have a video which is lost I'm low-key trying to find this so I can edit it and I'm gonna post that because you guys never saw me unbox these right here and it's not right bro I gotta post that let me know if y'all want me to post that there was some pretty fire items in that video but we do have this Ramelzi T right here fire this is the blue graffiti joint got all like these designs in the back I actually love this piece it has more logos on the sides it has literally logos on every side of the shirt which is so fire in my opinion then they got that small box logo at the bottom as you can see super clean piece i feel like that collab is so underrated but we also did have the ramelzi t which this one i'm debating on holding simply because he's wearing the box logo you never know bro this might end up going up so i'm gonna probably hold this piece right here definitely clean i love the way that the blues came out for these pieces so we got a couple more pieces to 
talk about. Then we're straight up out the building. Low key, I'm about to rush it with these because this video is long as shit. We did get the Motion Logo skate deck. I feel like the shape on this one is pretty weird, but the skate deck in itself is definitely a vibe. I love the way that the red pops on this one. I just feel like if you hang it up on your wall or even if you skate it, if you're a skater boy, you can go ahead and do that. But this one is definitely staying in the collection. I just love the Supreme Motion Logo. Probably one of my favorite logos, low key. We also did cook up on the Supreme COVID-19 Murakami box logo. Low key, I'm sad that I'm letting this go, but I need a whip right now. And this is 500 beans that low key could definitely help. And it is brand new, obviously. I opened it just to show you guys and do a review. The Murakami box logo, super clean in my opinion. I just feel like it's not my size. It's gonna go up in the future hands down and I'm gonna regret it, but I'd rather just cop my whip. We also did get the Motion Logo beanie. Shout out to Marco, nothing on the back. Motion Logo on the front. We got the beanie, we got the skate deck, and we got something else that I'm gonna show y'all in a little bit. Supreme Motion Logo. It's literally just the logo on the front, but it is sewn in, which is a great detail to it. We have a couple tees, which I haven't opened yet. This is gonna be in a future unboxing, so you will only know that I got these if you watch this video right here. This is the Ichi the Killer tee in like a pale yellow colorway. Super clean color. It's like a banana cream yellow in a way. Ichi the Killer tee. We also got the Supreme Marble tee in a navy color. Both of these tees are staying in the collection. Both fire pieces. My girl actually bought me some stuff as a pre-anniversary gift and whatever I'm going to show you right now is actually a part of that. First she got me this cool ass Supreme beanie which you guys did see in a different video. Super fire. It's like a cream color with like a baby blue on the front. It's low key getting blown out by the lights but it's fire if you can see right there. She also managed to get me the Supreme Motion logo tee in like an ash gray colorway. This is my size as well. Super fire in my opinion. This is actually one of the better colorways to me. The last one she got me was the lizard tee which you can see right here. It got the little lizard on the top. Supreme logo going across. The little canteen at the bottom right there. Super clean piece. This is also in a gray colorway. I believe this is heather gray. Super fire. One of the last pieces that I got was this Supreme TNF jacket and this yellow goldish black color right here. This is the one that came with the vest, the RTG line. Supreme TNF jacket and like this black and goldish type color. Black and gold, black and yellow. You decide. Super fire piece, but I just can't keep it, bro. Not for the price that it's going for, especially when I'm trying to do bigger and better things. I almost did forget to talk about this item right here and it actually was the Supreme Heller mugs. I did manage to get these. Shout out to Marco once again. He actually hooked it up and I got my girl one for retail. This is the Heller mugs. Super clean. Says Supreme on the front right there. Another fire accessory. I feel like as far as accessories go, I'm gonna probably end up keeping all of them because I just love the way that the accessories look and they add a little bit to my room if you can see behind me. And if you're able to see around my room, you low key will see that these definitely do a lot to my room. All the accessories. This is another fire one right here. Speaking of accessories, we got two more accessories. Then we're straight up out the building. We did manage to get the Supreme glow in the dark Zippo. It has Supreme going all across it. This is fire. I love the way that this looks. It's just super clean, bro. Got that Supreme, but it also does glow in the dark. The last piece that I want to show you guys in this video, and I feel like I am missing some shit. Like I could recall low key. I forgot to talk about the Tupac T. I did manage to get this one as well. I'm not going to sell this one because I feel like in the future it'll be worth more, but this is the Tupac hologram T. But I got a bunch of shit as you can see. I feel like I spent racks on Supreme and we got this chair right here, which was fire. The lawn chair. I really wish I would have got two. I didn't even know you could buy two, but I did manage to get one. Shout out to Marco. The lawn chair is actually insane. I feel like this is one of the pieces that in the future it will go up. The Supreme branding on it is impeccable. It's just a clean chair, bro. If you have a set of these, you definitely are winning. I low key don't want to destroy this, but I do want to use it in a way. Fire piece, Supreme blasted all throughout. And low key, bro, I think that's pretty much it. I feel like I covered as much as I possibly could. I know for a fact that I missed some tees. I missed a hat for sure. It's under there somewhere, so I'm not even trying to go get it. But if you did enjoy this video, slap a like on it down below. Subscribe to the channel. If you are new and would enjoy more of this type of content, click the post notification bell so you're notified each and every time I post a new video and get this video to 250 likes or 300 likes and whatever video has the most likes in the comment, I will go ahead and record and make it for you guys. But I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one. Peace, stay up, and I'm out.
They say they want a real one, they say they want a real one to make them feel young. 